This morning, a Lincoln Park woman is quarantined at home after finding out she has COVID-19. We're talking to her about her symptoms, hospital visits, testing, and what's next. CBS 2's Audrina Biggis is live in Lincoln Park where the woman waits for word from health officials. Audrina. Good morning, Ryan. Deborah Westfall is now the second person in her Lincoln Park condo building to be tested and testing positive for COVID-19. Just last year, she battled and won breast cancer, and now she's dealing with this. Now, we're going to keep the name of her Lincoln Park condo building private for the protection and the security of the residents there, but Deborah did share her story with us. I don't know if the worst is behind me or if the worst is yet to come. But I'm, I'm really scared. Deborah Westfall is FaceTiming me from her living room in Lincoln Park. That's where she's been told to stay after learning she has COVID-19. It goes from being surreal to being real. Deborah's symptoms started last Wednesday. So what we did is we mapped out a timeline from then until now, one week. It started on Wednesday. That's when she started experiencing cough, low energy, and body aches. The same symptoms continued Thursday, Friday, and to Saturday, she did start feeling better then, but was still coughing. And on Sundays, when she found out that someone in her condo building might have COVID-19. On Monday, the association at her Lincoln Park condo building sent this email, confirming one person in the building tested positive for COVID-19. Since then, we obtained this picture of crews in hazmat suits cleaning the building. Deborah, who was still experiencing a cough and shortness of breath on Monday, called her primary care doctor. The doctor told you to go to a clinic. You went to the clinic. Talk about your experience there. They immediately shuffled me to a private room. Um, I kind of skipped the line. They swabbed her throat and nose. And that they were going to be mailing my test off uh, for the, to test for the coronavirus. They gave me a face mask to wear and told me to really um, focus on social distancing, not to come within six feet of anybody. 